Sophia, try to walk over here. I can't walk. I don't know. <laughs> we just met the other day. I saw your smile from far away. I came right up to you and said, How about we sit instead? I told you my life was beginning. The moment I saw you, I was winning. Already. Cute. Oh my god. She is so cute. Look at her. Eee. Oh my god. We talked for hours and time went fast. We made a bond we hope would last. In silence or in screaming noise. Spotted. Morning. Morning. That's a horrible acting. <laughs> but Are you telling me that's not natural? You know what is you know what is natural? This awesome new machine that Mama Rose has got. Mama's new toy. <laughs> Look at this. So you're being a good son, man. You're yeah. being a good son. Man got shirt also. <laughs> Oh my gosh! Mama Rose, where did you get this from? From the online. The online. The online solves everything. She's got a new Kagood electronic version. I bought this one because Kaye Lobot Sakit. Kaye Lobot Sakit, Kagood. I like how quiet it is. Yeah. So, in case you're wondering, She's really happy about getting this because now you can make lots of cocoa oil. Cocoa oil. And VCO, virgin coconut oil. And virgin coconut oil. And I and noticed. She can cook easily crabs. And now she can cook easily crabs. I also noticed this morning she's been cooking coconut sugar. We're gonna have crabs today for our brunch. I just overheard something. And she's marked. Cheers, cheers, Max. I'm going to cheers, miss, cheers, miss. Okay. I was saying, this machine didn't come with the langana on it already. Yeah. So, he, he, he attached this bowl to the foxy because that, that was what he could uh, that's what he could find. So I was saying that maybe he's the real MacGyver. Oh. oh. Well, you know, you know what they say? The, the younger brothers aspire to be like their older brothers, yeah. right? <laughs> See, he models me. <laughs> oh! Oh! Cheers, uh, miss. Cheers, miss. It was Cheers, my miss. driver who thought about buying the... The bail. The uh, uh, the basin. Oh, okay, so it was... Uh, he's, he's still the... He's still the... So, guy yeah. so he fact, do it. fact of the uh, day, Chismis is always incorrect. Yes! <laughs> but, other fact of the day, it's the new 6G network in the Philippines. Because mm -hmm. it's super fast and spreads everywhere. <laughs> the 6G. 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 <laughs> oh. oh, 6G. Can I just give a shout out to Mama Rose who always wants to hard work and do all the hard stuff? Like, we, we were just watching you grind that. <laughs> Look at that. Amazing. See? And uh, you know, this one is easier to grind mm -hmm. for keto flour. Oh. For the keto dieters. Uh, We're not keto. Cocoa no, flour. They don't. They have these. My wife. Okay, we got things to do. See you in a bit. I still cannot believe that's a bus. Yes. This road used to be like gnarly. Gnarly. Yeah. And now there's a bus. It's an aircon bus. A nice new looking aircon bus. Yeah. That always breaks down going over the hill. <laughs> For some reason. <laughs> always in the same place. <laughs> oh. 
I am on a mission with Commander. Uh, we are driving somewhere. I haven't been in many, 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 many months, and we both have reason to go there. So, that's all. We'll see you later when we stop to eat food and get something to drink because we haven't had breakfast yet. We're yes. missing Mama Rose's breakfast. Why did crabs, we leave? Crabs for crabs brunch. for brunch. With coconut milk. Why? Santa, all. Santa, all those crabs. Uh, but seriously, there's a bus and we're driving. Okay, see you in a bit. Yeah, <laughs> see you. Guess what time it's going to be soon, Commander? Breakfast. Face boss time. Yeah. yeah. This, this place, is... Ah, oh, sorry, I, I just interrupted you. No, um, you go. This place is awesome if you're travelling north from Davao. It's in Marab, it's known for the Birinka, but actually the food's really, really good as well. I actually interrupted you, so my bad. Ah, okay. Axel Dave, <laughs> here we go. Oh, I gotta put sandals on. Where's my chinelas? What are you My name is Wintag. Oh, legit. Okay, ready? oh man. This is a legit selection. Holy smokes. Is that Pompano? Pompano, Yes, Pompano. They have Mama Rose's favorite fish, Pompano. Good news. We decided to get the ginormous Nilumbaran and Moron Suman. Actually, this is a Moron. It's ginormous, it's full of chocolate, it's rice based. Mm. The texture is like like a pudding cake. Mm. And then this isn't just a giant suman, it's a giant Nilumbaran suman, which is also chocolatey inside. Mm. Mm. Good choice, Commander D. <laughs> the Buddha moves massive, I still haven't finished. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the highway through Tagum City. Uh, yeah, that was really good food earlier. And now, because we're gonna be driving for a while, we're just gonna do a quick 
Five questions with Commander D. Number one, what's your favorite Philippines fruit? Oh, mango. Number two, what's your favorite province of the Philippines? Davao Oriental. <laughs> Number Good three, answer. what's your favorite Visaya word? Ah, uh, Butangi. I thought you were going to say Dao, anyways. <laughs> <laughs> I did, it. Number, number four, if you can go to holiday anywhere in the Philippines right now, where would you go? Ooh, uh, go uh, Bukidnon. Really? First thing that came to mind. Okay. <laughs> I, I love Bukidnon. <laughs> I, like, uh, I do love Bukidnon. Last question. What's your real other name? Besides Ansel and Commander D. Ah, you got me. That's, that's, that's private information. Okay. And only for the knowledge of the barangay. Back to the road. Whoa. The dusty downtown Otago. I like it though. It's exciting, man. Look at that. I know. <clears throat> it's exciting because I've been coming through here every week for the last while. And I just keep watching little things being built. Nice. I mean, now it's on the up. Mm. Hello. I love the little green tricycles. So cool. <laughs> I love how colors change on tricycles everywhere. Yes, this opened, I think, last week. Or two oh weeks ago. Oh my gosh. Two weeks ago, you can see the flags. It opened the Pinabo flyover. Flyovers everywhere here. We're about to fly over one. Let's fly. enjoy this together. guy's trying to sell. No, I'm, I'm, I'm very distracted by him. It looks like a plant in a plastic cup. We're in Davos City now. <laughs> We're actually pulling into Kama Street and there's a guy... We're oh, we can't... Right We're gonna see him right oh, now. that's... Uh, we, can't, we can't stop though. We can't stop. What's this? Oh, I that's would cool. love to buy his plant. Uh, but, dude, I totally... Yeah. Honestly, okay, if I'm we were still stopped, we had to go because of the light. Yeah. That's cool, guys are selling plants. I think there's a new thing called Plantita Plantito. Have you seen that? Becoming so, Tito. Becoming, becoming Plantito. Yeah. Uh, yeah, but that, that, I've never seen a plant. I've never seen inside. anyone trying to peddle a plant on the street before. That's hilarious. Yeah, okay, this is People's Park in front of us, yes. right here. It's we are in the heart of Davos City. Wow, I miss you, People's Park. I'm assuming it's closed, yes. maybe. Yeah. Temporarily closed, no mask, no entry. Oh, maybe you I'm can. not really sure what's happening. Um, Commander's driving me to a Sony authorized repair center. I have to bring my cameras to be fixed and... That guy's sleeping. He put his mask over his eyes. <laughs> <laughs> what, like this? <laughs> legend. Oh, legend. <laughs> As you can see, I am in a hotel. Uh, this is the first time I've been in a hotel. In a long time. So I just thought I'd randomly show you it. Uh, I checked into Seda right next to Ibiza Mall here in Davao because I need to go in there and get some stuff fixed with uh, some electronics and buy a few things as well. Welcome to my room. As you can see, it actually just kind of looks like what it normally looks like, but there are a few unique differences. So everything is saran wrap. Check it out. Saran wrap phone, saran wrap remote. There's the mall. Going in that mall in a bit. Saran wrap other phone. And I noticed, the other thing I noticed is that there's no more like bathrobes or, I think usually they have bathrobes, but they do have the, the slippers. 
Um, yeah, it just, it's just, actually, my mind is a bit blown. Because uh, I'm in a hotel room in Tabo City. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna go shopping. And the reason I didn't go and stay with Anselm is he's got so many things to do right now too. And then he obviously wants to see his wife and I don't wanna, and his dogs and, and his family and stuff. So I don't wanna just invade. So he'll actually come meet me tomorrow morning and we'll head back to Katahil. Uh Yeah. <laughs> I'm in a hotel room, this is so weird. <laughs> Cause it's been so long. Woo. Um, okay, sort of my errands. Out from the mall slash jungle outside the mall. Victory. Almost everything's done. I gotta go back in later. Sorry I'm a bit low-key on filming uh, right now because I'm just trying to do the errands, not draw too much attention to myself. I'm going back at a hotel. It's so weird. I hope all the hotel industry booms in the near future because it's so tough on everybody. Alright. Hey guys, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna end this on kind of a reflective, serious, but positive note. Um, you know, I, I know over the past months, I've been, over the past years, I've been so lucky uh, and blessed to be in the situations I've been in, uh, be surrounded by the people I've been surrounded by, to get to eat the things I get to eat, to get to you know, have the things I have, to have the ability to you know, for example, come to Davao today and, and go and buy electronics and, you know, and then now stay in like a nice hotel across the street from it. And, um, you know, one thing I just wanted to quickly let everybody know is if you really look back and, and, and read my writing and, and, and if you've ever met me as a person, I, I really promise you that I'm, I'm, I'm paying it forward and uh, I'm doing you know, what I can to help people. But one thing is every now and again, I see a few comments. It's just a few and I don't even dwell on them. And, and but I, I just, I find these kind of comments, ones that maybe, you know, need to be addressed. Cause it's people saying, hey, why don't you give more? Hey, why don't I see you helping? Or, hey, Kulas, why don't you? And here's the thing is that one thing I've learned over the past, you know, years, decades of my life. And especially here in the Philippines, since I've been through things like typhoon disasters and earthquakes and, you know, involved in programs and hang out with people in very difficult situations and, and seen people and recorded people in difficult situations is, you know, some of the best ways you can help or some of the best ways you can give back are just by doing it and doing it without showing it, without, uh, you know, without feeling you have to show it. Should we show it from time to time? And other times it's very appropriate to? Absolutely. And can it empower more people that, to give and help and, 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 you know, share their blessings? Absolutely. We can all help and you don't even have to give things to help. It can just be, you know, even just a listening ear or, or just a positive gesture. I guess that might be giving things because you're giving a positive gesture. Anyways, the fact is, thank you guys for being a part of this community and inspiring me to be a better person all the time. And I'll see you tomorrow if I film.
which I probably will because you really inspire me a lot. So good night. I don't, I don't know how to turn these off. Oh, got it. Okay. Got to get used to, this is weird. Good night.